And this is my iPad Pro. I got it for around $375 from Best Buy during a small promotion. iPad Pro currently retails for $600. I don't think it's worth $600. Why? Because it's just for media consumption. Watching videos, surfing the internet. If you're older, like over 50 or 60, you'll use it as a camera, but I wouldn't use this thing as a camera. It's just so clunky. Uh, if you can, uh, I really don't see a difference in the iPad Air 2 versus the iPad Pro. Spec-wise, it's better. Sure, it's, you know, it's faster processor, slightly better screen, it's a little brighter. Oh yeah, it has a better camera, so if you really need to spend two, three hundred dollars or four hundred dollars for a, a tablet that does just a little bit better, then go for it. Uh, I think that the iPad Pro and most tablets should only cost three hundred dollars. If it has LTE, maybe four hundred dollars, so that's my very short-sighted opinion. I think these iPads are overpriced so I suggest if you want a tablet right now that's an Apple product just get the iPad Air 2 instead of the iPad Pro especially if all you do is surf the internet and just use some apps I don't think you'll see a big difference in performance going from the Pro to the iPad Air 2 I, I don't notice it when I use my wife's iPad Air 2 so just wanted to get that off my chest.